Cool. I don't think that you guys watch my vlog. I don't think anyone really watches my vlog, but that's awesome. Bean tries to sabotage my vlog a lot, but um, she's just as sweet as kitten. You're just as sweet as kitten. So bless me. Maybe it wasn't even in the last video, but notice it now. Ooh, it's really awesome, actually. I'm not gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry on my vlog. Yeah, you gotta clean that lens before you start the video. What is up, guys? Mike Wheats here, back again. It's vlog 76. I did 70 freaking six of these things already. <laughs> Got off work tonight, this morning. It's like, I don't know what time it is, but it's probably like two in the morning or like three in the morning even by now because I've done like 47 takes and I just, I wanna get this off my chest, but I don't know exactly how to do it. So I'm just gonna do it. And I've got a funny story for you guys. I'm gonna get to that in a minute, but I felt like I should just come up here, sit on these stairs, you know, feed my cat, Beanie. What are you doing, Bubba? There's one thing that a cat can't resist that I've found. It's uh, the hand under the carpet trick or like the sheet or whatever. She seems impervious to it though. So I'm just gonna stop doing that. It's kind of awkward. Anyway, I'm here to create content for you guys. That's what I love to do. I love making videos. I like editing videos. And I like even more just getting solid takes and not editing videos. But I like making content, whether it's music or... Uh, or videos or whatever the thing is it is um i like creating stuff i like making stuff i should be showing you why i'm making this video i'm gonna pick this up <laughs> i'm gonna turn the light on dingus i'm gonna plug that in i'm not really sure what it goes to but i'm here in the barn because i had a band here setting up earlier and i turned the light on and i was like wait no i'm just gonna do this for the vlog i'm just gonna see what they what they set up so i'm going to be tracking these guys in a couple days and i got a bunch of like lighting equipment that i'm going to start slowly turning on now if you believe it it could be real pretty sure somebody wrote a book about that and then like oprah talked about it so i'm really upping my game with my lighting and stuff i've got this tripod i've got this already that's pretty cool but Check these out. They're just like freaking bright as hell. Um, but they really accent the room well. So, oh my gosh, look at this. This already lives here, but amps, amps, a tiny little drum kit, oh my gosh. A tiny little cat behind a tiny, yeah. Oh uh, wow, this is stingus. You sick? Little orange, tiny terror. Mics, they got SM57s. Brought some SM57s. Oh my gosh. They got... Wow, they already set up like all their mics and stuff. That's awesome. So I'm giving these guys a great deal. Whatever, I'm not gonna get into the schematics about it, but basically I'm trying to turn this place into a venue again. I'm trying to make like studio sessions and stuff. That's like a side hustle or whatever. This is a drone vlog. We should be flying drones. I'll fly, I'll throw in some tiny whoop footage after this so you can really get more of a lay of the land but this is sick this is so sick four microphones one two three and four one thousand watts of pa system one ladder with projectors that's awesome funny story i got offered a job i love my job as you can see i like rep root down like hard as fuck all the time I love my job, I really do. I got offered a job at another kitchen. Um, I don't love working in kitchens, but I do love Root Down, Root Down's an enigma. And I was like, whoa, 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 like $60 an hour? I think I misheard him, I think he said 16, but even that's a little bit ridiculous because he doesn't know me. And I, he was like, I like your energy, dude. I think that you should come work on my line for 60 bucks an hour. And I was like, thinking about it. And I was like, no, that's ridiculous. So I'm pretty sure he said 16, but like either way, this is where the story gets a little weird. I met this lady who was in the uh, Air Force. I was in the Navy, the men's department of the Navy, the Marine Corps. And she, like, we just hit off, we were just like talking, talking. And I was like, oh, I used to work at this restaurant. It's really swanky, it's really French, really Italian, really fucking 
nice and stuff, expensive. Not really my scene, but um, she like does food reviews. She's like a foodie or whatever. I don't really know much about that, but um, she gets like an allowance to go to restaurants and like she has to look for all these like things. Like, do they put their thumbs up? Do they put their thumbs down? Do they like do this? Do they do that or whatever? I don't really know, but she was like, I have to eat all this food and I can't eat it all, so come with me. And I go to the restaurant that this guy offered me a job to. I thought that was kind of weird, I don't know. But then, here's where it gets even weirder. I did this internship in like 2008, 2009, I'm 2007. I don't really know, somewhere in there. I don't really want to talk too much about it, but like, <laughs> I like when my cat comes in, she, uh, the bell rings a little bit. I don't know if you could hear that, but, ooh, I'm rambling. So basically, I get this email from a person who I used to intern for about a job that I, he was like, when I interned for him, it was a free internship, which is bullshit, but I learned a lot. And I learned a lot that I didn't even like realize I was learning, which is funny how that happens sometimes, but it's like so good. He emails me and he's like, hey, I got this job for you. There's more to it. You'll, I, I can't really talk about it. It's, it's fucking weird. Anyway. This is more what I'm trying to do. Got an email from a dude who totally aligns with like my music production and my sound engineering and, and what I do and what I want to do and my dreams. So I'm super hype on it. That's all I'm going to say. I'm hype as fuck. I've already said too much, but this is like a pretty good take. Anyway, so I'm up here. I haven't, this is my first look at their setup and it's super freaking rad. This backdrop is for Barnfest 5, but it's perfect timing that I have this band coming in, The Classic Hunt. Um, I'll put a link to their music in the description. Um, and let me see where my other lights are at. I guess they didn't, they didn't, did they plug these in? Is this like, is this, oh, there's, oh, nice. They brought a board and everything. Jeez, they're like really, so this Fender Rhodes was living here already. It's a beautiful thing. And this is my xylophone. So we have a little studio tour here now too. Um, this is not my equipment and this is a beautiful board. Look at this. What is this? What are this? I'm totally a gear slut. You guys probably don't know this about me. I am totally a sound, anything that has to do with sound, engineering, processing, fucking anything like i love it pedals all day dude the memory man the digital delay a staple the gravy how can you have taters without gravy you know what i mean i've never seen this before but i guarantee it sounds great awesome awesome the loop station Pew! Oh baby, I used to have one of those. I actually love that thing. I want another one. I'm not really sure what else I should do with these lights. So like I have, I picked up these 3000 watt lights for like really cheap. I'm thinking that it's really cheap. They're really old, but they work. So I don't know. They're going to get a lot of love. Thanks so much, Alexa's dad, for, for, uh, for letting me use these, letting me buy these off of you. It's really, it's really awesome actually. I'm not going to cry. I'm not going to cry on my vlog. But uh, what I will do is fly my tiny whoop in here and cut to some footage of that and stop boring you mother mm -hmm. There's gonna be so much content coming out of this place. I can't even explain it to you. I can't even put it into words, but this is like a human thing. This is like a real video. I didn't plan this. It's kind of off the top of my dome. My cat is <laughs> now f***ing up this, this thing. It's a little belated, but she's like, just overjoyed that this carpet is here. Happiest cat in the world. Ladies and gentlemen, happiest cat in the world. Oh shit, secret end scene cuts. Cuts, 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 secret fucking shit that shouldn't have been in the vlog, but now it's in the vlog. Shit, it's my grind station. I got a tiny vice. Shoot, I got a tiny light. I got a little pegboard. I got like a bunch of stuff i got this thing that i made that i thought was gonna be cock diesel but it didn't even work and uh i've got the charger for my gopro so i can make this vlog thanks so much for watching peace